Hi friends, welcome back to my channel and a very special welcome if you're new here. My name is Jen, I'm a certified weight loss and nutrition coach who has lost and maintained a 140 pound weight loss and it is massive grocery haul time, stock up haul, $550 from two stores. So if you're excited, give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not, turn your bell on because I do a grocery haul every Saturday and I actually upload five videos every single week. Down in the description box, you will find nutrition coaching. Highly, highly recommend those personalized macros and calories. That is what I follow to lose and maintain my weight loss as well as one-on-one -on -one coaching for questions, accountability, or to talk with me directly. Links, discounts to my favorite things and come join our Facebook group it's free. We would love to have you. So let's head into the kitchen for this massive haul. So here's part one of this massive, massive grocery haul. It is stock up time. Not to mention, I have a super exciting fall video coming your way. So I picked up everything for that as well as all of our groceries for the week. Oh, and this first part of my haul is from Fry's, which is my local Kroger store. They had some amazing deals. Their Chobani creamers were two for five, so $2.50 each. That's a great deal. So I picked up the cinnamon coffee cake. This is just the regular Chobani. And then I've never tried the zero sugar sweet cream, so I grabbed it. I've been doing my cold brew with the cold foam and a little bit of cream. So I've been doing coffee at home more using creamer. I also got this eight pack of burgers for Troy for $3.48. That's an amazing deal. It's starting to get a little cooler here. So I want to start doing a little bit more barbecuing. And then I grabbed some organic chicken thighs for a recipe. That is a really good deal for organic chicken. They had a couple of the light and fit. This is the strawberry cheesecake. These are reduced for 72 cents each. So I picked up a couple. I do have some yogurts already, so I didn't want to over buy, but I'll definitely eat those two in the next couple of days. Their family size of Cheez-Its were less than $3 a box when you bought two. So I actually bought two family size boxes. So we will definitely have those for a very long time. I do have my boot camp girls day coming up at the lake. And then I'm also going to make decoupage pumpkins with some of my girlfriends another night. So I'll bring these with me. And you guys know I love having Cheez-Its as a crunchy side. So these two boxes will definitely last me a while. This is, I've never seen this before. This is from Simple Joy's Bakery. This is the cinnamon swirl little breads. I picked those up for Troy. And then I got the little mini blueberry scones. I had one of these on my way home from the grocery store. Love these. They're super, super good and they're small. So they're literally the perfect little size. The Thomas, the Thomas English muffin were two for six. So I grabbed two of the 100 calorie. I like these ones because they have protein and fiber. So I prefer those. I am going to be going to Costco this week. You'll see that Costco haul next. If they have the regular Thomas English muffins, I buy those for Troy, but I like these because of the fiber and the protein. The Tillamook cheeses, slices, shreds are buy one, get one free. So that makes them $2.25 a bag. So I got mozzarella for a recipe and then just traditional Mexican four cheese blend. Some organic chicken broth for a recipe quite a few canned goods. I needed a little baby tomato sauce as well as some canned pumpkin. Like I said, we got a lot of fun pumpkin recipes, fall recipes coming your way. Their pizza sauce, this brand, Delalo, was buy one, get one free. So two for $3 and it's only 30 calories a serving. So since we're doing a pizza night, I picked that up. I also am going to be making two ingredient dough. So I grabbed some self-rising flour, Unsweetened applesauce, I use this in place of oil in recipes. And like I said, I have fall recipes coming and they are baking, they're sweet recipes. So I picked up some more unsweetened applesauce, some cottage cheese. They did not have the low fat cottage cheese from Good Culture, they only had the whole milk. So I just picked the whole milk up. And again, lots of baking coming. So some brown sugar as well as some powdered sugar and some white chocolate chips. I really like the private selection brand and it was cheaper than the Nestle brand. And this is just a way better quality white chocolate or chocolate chip. So if you have a Kroger, get the private selection brand. Really, really good. I also got two things of beef summer sausage for Troy. These were on coupon for $2.50 a piece. So really good price. And then for myself, I got the Gilbert's Caprese chicken sausage. I am making a recipe using sausage. You'll actually see what's on my menu for dinners and meal prep right after the grocery haul. Lots of lunch meat because you guys know I've been loving my unwitches. Troy eats a breakfast sandwich, makes one every day. So the uncured oven roasted turkey, no nitrites, no nitrates. That's my favorite from Foster Farm. This is $3.29 on sale. So I got the oven roasted 
and the mesquite smoked. And then I also picked up some uncured ham. These are on digital coupon, this Oscar Mayer deli brand, $3.50 a pack. So I got uncured ham for Troy, and then this is a turkey ham mixture. So lots and lots of lunch meat for the week. A small thing of whole milk for a recipe, and then Troy always just drinks whatever's left. And then he does have a gallon left in the fridge, surprisingly, from last week. So I picked up one more gallon of not of one percent milk for him three packages of one third less fat cream cheese for that fall baking recipe and then the knutson cottage cheese doubles these are a 10 for 10 right now so a buck a piece i think walmart they're 115 or 120 so cheaper right now at fries or kroger stores so i got one pineapple one peach and one strawberry. Some strawberries, these are 97 cents a piece. Really, really good deal. Bananas for a recipe, and then obviously just for a fruit for the week. Butternut squash, I did not want to cut it up myself, so I bought it already pre-cut up. Russet potatoes for a recipe. Granny Smith apples, also for a recipe. And then I am doing an apple meal prep, but I have a couple apples in my fridge. So I picked up one more just to make sure I had enough for the recipe. Celery and carrots also for a dinner recipe. And what you don't see from fries is a 24 pack of a Diet Coke for Troy. So let's go ahead and jump into what I picked up at Costco. So here's the rest of my haul from Costco. Massive, massive haul. I haven't been to Costco in months. What you don't see is a case of water and a case of Gatorade Zero. So the first thing I picked up is Premier Protein. I only have a couple more cases of shakes left and I have them every single day. And I have never bought the birthday cake one, so I'm excited to try it in my protein coffee. I also grabbed two boxes of the makeup wipes. These are my all-time favorite. Really affordable, $13.99, and there's 180 wipes per box. They reformulated these, and they're even better. They're really thick, they're really wet. I love them, so I picked up two more boxes. The mouthwash for Troy, he always says that the Listerine is too spicy. I call it spicy. He says it's the alcohol in there, but I did get the Crest Complete Care. This is alcohol-free. Also need a refill of vanilla extract. This was only $9.99. That's an amazing deal. And I also picked up some nuts because I always buy them at the grocery store, and they're so expensive. So I got a big bag of walnuts. I am on a mission to use more walnuts in my diet. They're really good for your heart. These were less than $10 for this huge bag. And then this big bag of pecans was also $10. And I've been roasting nuts and then putting them on my yogurt bowl and in my oatmeal just for that nice healthy fat. And Costco really has the best price. Also got this four pack of 93.7 ground turkey. I am going to start making Lola's food for her. She doesn't like the kibble that's made for the kidney diet and she also doesn't like the canned food. So I don't want her to get too much protein. So I found a few recipes online that basically contain some type of meat, rice, a vegetable, and an egg. So I'm going to make food for Lola. So this was $20 for four pounds. So this will last me well over a month for her. I also got pretzel crisps because they were only $8.99 for the big bag. I love these with peanut butter, with pretzels, just as a crunchy side. I also got some dried mangoes. You guys know how much I love my dried mangoes. I ate some of those on the way home. I count them as zero points because they have the same macros as fresh mango, and these ones don't have any added sugar anyway. So however you want to count them, I count them as zero. I also got two loaves of Troy's favorite bread, and I got a big bag of pure cane sugar. I do plan on baking a lot with the upcoming holidays. This had a little hole in it, and they were so nice there. They put tape on it for me, put it in a bag, Super nice. I'm actually going to empty this into my sugar container and then that should get rid of the whole little tiny hole that was in here. And this sugar is really, really good. It's pure cane sugar. Ginormous pack of bacon. It's super, super thick bacon. We've been loving BLT. So I got that. I'm gonna throw it in the freezer. That way if we need a quick, easy dinner, we have bacon on hand for BLTs. I also got a big box of Kind Minis. This whole box was $10. That was such a great deal. I don't know if they're not gonna carry them anymore because I remember them being way more than that, but it's 30 36 of the little kind mini bars. There's the peanut butter dark chocolate and the caramel almond sea salt. I got some laundry stuff, these Downies scent beads. These were on coupon for $13.99. And then a refill of our dishwasher detergent. A big four pack of Thomas English muffins for Troy and me. I love making English muffin breakfast sandwiches. I eat an English muffin with peanut butter a lot before and after the gym. $8.99 for four pack. I also got fabric softener because we are just about out. This was a new food find for me. These are from the company Magic Spoon and these are their high protein cereal bars. So there's one gram of total sugars, 12 grams of protein, and like 140 calories per bar. 
there's double chocolate and chocolate peanut butter. So basically like a Rice Krispie treat with protein. Again, great pre post workout. Like I said, I want to take more hikes. I have a 5k coming up tomorrow. So this will be great for that. You got 14 bars and it was $19.99. And again, it's from Magic Spoon. I got some brioche buns. I made burgers last night for dinner. We didn't have any buns and I got buns for Troy. I also got Baby Bell cheese. I was going to get string cheese, but Baby Bells were on coupon for I think $9. So I picked those up. I also got the big pack of Tillamook cheese slices. We just go through a lot of cheese in this house in general. And then a refill of Tylenol Rapid Relief. I also got some more of my Chosen Foods Avocado Mayo. Love this mayo, nice clean ingredients. A big pack of hard-boiled eggs for Lola's food because you do put hard-boiled eggs in there. I love them as a snack. We make egg salad out of these a lot. It's just a really great deal. $10.99 for 16 two-packs, so excellent price. I also got some Kirkland brand of the pods. They have the same ingredients as Tide Pods. These were a lot cheaper, so I grabbed those. Also a big container of Fa A Total 0% Yogurt. I'm making two ingredient dough this week. Plus I've been making a lot of yogurt things in general. Just a really good way to get in lots of protein. This was $6.99, which is the price of the smaller one at the grocery store. I got some nectarines. I couldn't pass them up. They're organic nectarines. This whole box, $9.99. Some potatoes, again, for Lola's dog food as well as for us for meals. I was excited to see this. This is new, a very superfood bite. Cran Dragon Fruit. These are individually wrapped. They're 90 calories, only eight carbohydrates, two grams of protein, and a gram of fiber. So they're these little superfood bites, and I love that they're individually wrapped. So we'll try those out together in a what I eat in a day. And then lastly are these freeze-dried liver bite treat things for Palmer. They are full of protein, which Palmer definitely needs as a smaller dog, as a younger dog, as an active dog. So those are only $6.99 and the only ingredient is liver. So I got those for Palmer. So that is everything that I picked up from Costco. Let's go ahead and jump into what's for dinners and what you'll see in Monday's meal prep. So here is what is on my menu for the week. So I'm making fall pizza with sausage and squash. You guys will see that recipe in Wednesday's What I Eat in a Day. And then I'm making creamy chicken and potato soup. We should have quite a bit of leftovers for the week. I also have a salad kit in the fridge. And then for Monday's meal prep, I'm so excited for this. We're doing maple banana muffins for breakfast, chicken, shiitake, dumplings, and rice for lunch. Cannot wait for that. And then I am making apple bread. So stay tuned on Monday for all three recipes in meal prep. Thank you for joining me for this week's grocery haul. I hope you enjoyed seeing everything I picked up. We are stocked up. We are ready to go. My next big haul will be at Sam's Club when I'm in need of toilet paper, paper towels, that type of thing. But I feel good that we've got everything we need for a healthy week, for a healthy month. So if you enjoyed the grocery haul, give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe, turn your bell on so you never miss a future video. And don't forget to check out the description box for nutrition coaching, links and discounts to my favorite things. And don't forget, come join our Facebook group we'd love to have you. Happy Saturday. Have an amazing weekend and I'll see you in tomorrow's video. Bye.